Would you I, I know there Islamophobia is. Islamophobia, that criticism of Islamism is not Islamophobic then? Islamophobia has gone up by 300%. So you think anti-Semitism anti is acceptable, but Islamophobia is not? I'm not saying anti-Semitism is, uh, is acceptable. In any A furious row broke out on GB News about Islamophobia amid the controversy surrounding Lee Anderson and the by-election win for George Galloway in Rochdale. It comes after suggestions the Workers' Party candidate mobilised the Muslim vote in the constituency to come out on top in what proved to be a contentious campaign. Mark Dolan pressed broadcaster Amy Nicol Turner on whether criticism of Islamism can be deemed as Islamophobic. Nicol Turner went on to suggest we live in an Islamophobic society fueled by narratives surrounding Islamists. Islamophobia has gone up by 300% from October 7th, she said. A critique of Israel is not instantly anti-Semitic. We're getting to a point where if you go to a march against Israel's military action, you're automatically deemed anti-Semitic. Mark Dolan went on to grill the GB News guest, asking, Would you confirm that criticism of Islam... Is not Islamophobic. 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 Of Islamism is not Islamophobic. Then Islamophobia has gone up by three hundred percent. So you think anti-Semitism anti is acceptable, but Islamophobia is not? I am not saying anti-Semitism is, uh, is acceptable. In any As she began to outline her argument, Dolan interjected, leaving Nickel Turner frustrated. You don't let me answer the question because you jump on me. She fumed. We do have an Islamophobic society because we harbour irrational threats of Islam all the time in our society, she added. Political commentator Emma Webb waded in on people being silenced for criticising Islam, saying it is seen as blasphemy. Bev Turner interjected to argue people need to be brought together. What we really want to do politically in this country is bring people together, she said. Now, you can see that there are people who have done, journalists who have investigated Islamism, who have been accused of Islamophobia, and, and people have tried to silence people from criticising Islam and extremism with accusations of Islamophobia. Amy. I don't see George Galloway saying, I am going to win on a Gaza ticket and then bring the Muslims and Jews together in my community. Standing on a ticket like this, it is always about creating more division. Former Tory party deputy chairman Lee Anderson accused Mayor of London Rishi Sunak of being controlled by Islamists and lost the Tory whip after failing to apologise. Anderson says he will stick to the sentiments of the comments but admitted they were a little bit clumsy in how they were articulated on GB News.